Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a daily vibes for the 26th, December 26th. This is for whoever it resonates with. It's not going to resonate with everybody. It may resonate with you or it may not. We'll see what happens. It's for whoever it resonates with. Daily energy for December 26th. Working hard. Somebody's been working really hard waiting for some sort of gain, you know, waiting for something to come come of this. Expecting. Expecting something. <laughs> but they may not be getting what they're expecting, okay? There's a there's like a loss of abundance here. Now, there's, this is like a completion of a family dynamic. You know, somebody may not have realized that, you know, somebody was coming to take what they had or something like that. Somebody may be getting ghosted. I don't know what that is, but somebody may. It's like this is a completion of a relationship. There's been fights. There's been arguments. There's no more stability. There's no more security. They may have expected it to grow, but there's no more growth. This is like, I don't know what that is. The angel of change. Trapped. Somebody has been trapped. Oh, but it looks like it's over. Look at those three crows. Or ravens or whatever it is. Somebody has been mentally trapped. Turn their back. Their thoughts have led them in the wrong direction. Led them nowhere. Uh oh. Ooh. Make sure this is zoomed in. Pretty good, huh? Yeah, there's been a there's been a uh, a loss of patience, and now they're moving on. Somebody is moving in a new direction. After they've been cheated, lied to, deceived, they've allowed themselves to stay stuck in a situation that is unharmonious and not peaceful. No abundance, no security. It's like, geez, some crow's been too much family feuds. There's been fighting. And it's like, I'm taking back my power. I'm taking back control of the situation. There's no more growth here. And it's like, there's this, I, I don't know if this is like the ghost of change or who that ghost is. But somebody is is coming. Somebody, like from above, divinely guided. Somebody, some, there's some sort of uh, change on the horizon, put it that way, with a devil card reversed as well. Somebody is taking back their power after expecting something to grow that had no more growth. Somebody is absolutely taking back their power here. About to face the masses, about to face the crowd, about to face, you know, society and do what's right for them, you know? It's going in a new direction towards something that is more suited for themselves after being stuck in an unhealthy situation for a long time. Being mentally trapped. Somebody was absolutely mentally trapped in an unhealthy situation. Now they're moving on. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, King of Wands. Could be a Gemini. Could be a Capricorn. Could be a Sagittarius. Um... Yeah, it looks like this. things have been too out of balance. There's been a lot of frustration here. There's been a lack of peace, a lack of harmony, a lack of uh, receiving what you expected to receive from this. And a lack of love. And it's like, you know what? 
I got something better suited for me, and it looks like we have this, I think this is like the angel of change. I don't even know, but that's what I keep hearing, the angel of change. Now, the, the lover's card here, it's like, we have an unexpected choice here. Somebody is going to be presented with a new option. With some, with, to head in a new direction down a better path towards somebody that is better suited for them. Now, this is also a card of consequences. Now, this is a card of choice. You, you get to choose what you want to do. Do you stay stuck or do you, you know, do you stay stuck where you're at, where you're in your own little prison, where there's drama and there's, family feuds and you're expecting more and it's never coming or do you take your power back that's your choice somebody is taking their power back right here absolutely somebody is taking their power back and because they do so there's an unexpected choice there's an unexpected option that is being presented to them and it's being brought this this option is being brought from above it is and it's a and it's an opportunity to bring balance and harmony back okay it is Somebody is going to be presented with a, probably a, a new opportunity for love, but you're going to have to choose to step out of your own prison to stay wherever you've been trapped. You have to choose to step out of the trap. You know, wherever you're trapped, you have to choose because this is a choice. You choose to be trapped, well, then you have to live with those consequences. If you choose to walk away from being trapped, you know, and you move on, it's funny. If you, you can choose to just leave that, leave that. Put yourself first. You can choose to move to a better place. And somebody is choosing to do that. Somebody is absolutely choosing to move to a better place. And it's the journey to balance and harmony. It's the, it is. And there's been a lack of balance and harmony here. So there has. I mean, six is about balance and harmony. This is about balance and harmony as well. And there's been a lack of it. And somebody is making a choice to move on to find it. You know, and when they make that choice, when they step out of their own head, they step out of their own thoughts, you know, and they decide, you know what, I don't care about the money. I don't care about what you have to offer. At this point, I care about my sanity. I care about myself. I care about, you know, bringing peace back to my life and you can keep the money. You know, you can keep the assets or whatever it is. You know, you can keep it. I'm taking back my power. I'm stepping out of my ego. And this is absolutely stepping out of your ego. The devil reversed. It's stepping out of your ego. It's like, and that's stepping away from the money. It's like, you keep the fucking money. Excuse my language. You keep the assets. You know, I'm not going to be trapped here just because of that, you know, because whatever. Anyway, somebody is shedding the old. They are. Somebody is shedding their old skin to, to bring success or taking action to complete a cycle. Somebody may be moving, like literally moving, like moving. This is really similar to the reading I did this morning for the 25th, 26th. It's very similar. So it's the sim same kind of energy. We have a, a choice here. We absolutely have a choice. You, you choose to stay trapped or you choose to move on. So that's your choice. There's consequences. This is a card of consequences. Absolutely. If you choose to stay trapped, there'll be no growth and there'll continue to be fights and feuds. You have the power. You have the tools. You have the resources to shed, to bring in something new, to bring success. And somebody is taking back their power. So there's no doubt about it. Somebody is taking back their power. There's absolutely no doubt. So because where they're at, it's just not practical. There's, there's, it's, just, it's not it's not now if somebody is finding their confidence and their courage and their strength to move on after they've been in an unharmonious situation you know they didn't want to they've lost their patience for this they've lost their patience for for this feud whatever it is it looks like there's some kind of feud going on here some sort of fight um and this person may feel like Extreme bliss is in a different is is on the other side. They feel like they they will find happiness once they move on. Right now they're cheating themselves from happiness. They're cheating themselves from from the happiness that they deserve. 
So this person, somebody is deciding to go after their bliss. I want my bliss. I'm moving on. Oh my gosh, look at these tens. Completion, 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 completion. I mean, that's what tens are. It's the end of one chapter. It's the end of one cycle. It's the end. I'm dropping this. I'm dropping the past. I'm dropping the burdens. I'm. It's too overwhelming. Somebody has been carrying an overwhelming load, but they can't carry it. I'm making a conscious change to break free. Somebody is breaking free from a toxic situation, and you can't pretend that they're not because that's what this card is reversed. Somebody is breaking free from something that stole their power. It stole their power. And it's like, you know what? I know there's happiness on the other side. And I have to drop this, so go find my happiness. I'm not going to cheat myself of happiness and peace and harmony anymore. And that's what happened. Somebody has been cheating themselves from happiness and peace and serenity and blessings. They've cheated themselves. It's like, no, I'm not. I'm not going to do that anymore. Cheated myself from happiness and blessings. I mean, you it is what it is. So, I mean, I'm not going to do that anymore. I'm ready. I'm ready to make this conscious change and break free. So somebody is absolutely breaking free today. They are breaking free. Dropping it. I'm dropping this load. I'm moving. I'm moving. Completion, completion, completion. The end, the end, the end. I give up. I give up. I have no fight left. My fight is gone. I'm closing this door. Let me out. Let me out of this mental prison. I can't take it anymore. Oh, God. Somebody's been living a lie. And now the pain is too great. Their power has been taken and somebody's taken their power back. There's been a lack of communication. You're dealing with somebody who can't communicate. And when they do communicate, it's like painful to even hear him talk and now it's like you know what? I'm taking back my power it's my power and I'm taking it back somebody has been in denial refusing to wake up but it's like they can't refuse it anymore I, you know somebody has been dishonest that's all there is to it and it's like, you know what? You want to lie to me? I'm done with the lies. I'm, done. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I am. I'm leaving. And because I'm going to find my happiness someplace else. Somebody that's better suited for me. And there is a better suitor here. Somebody is making a conscious change to go in a new direction. Yeah, happiness. I'm looking for happiness. I'm looking for commitment. I'm looking for love. I'm looking for marriage. I'm looking for a lot of togetherness. I'm looking for a strong foundation. I'm looking for my best friend. This is, you know, if you have not met this person yet, you could meet this person at a party, okay? There's some kind of gathering. Could be in four days. Um, there's somebody new here. So there's a new, let me just change this a little bit. There's a new love here. Somebody is releasing something for good. Another person is headed towards a new relationship. Could be the same person. This is for thousands and th thousands of people. So take what resonates and, and let the other person have theirs. There is a new connection here with somebody that you didn't expect. And this could lead to, you know, could start out as friendship and lead to love. And you can meet this person at some sort of gathering. You might meet them in four days. 
This could be four days after you release, after you make a conscious change, or somebody else releases you, whatever. Um, when one door closes, another door opens, and I, I see that here, and I don't, I, don't need the, I don't need the death card to see that. I don't. I can see that there is a new opportunity here with somebody that you are very, very well suited for. You may not recognize them at first because they don't look like the last one, but you will recognize them soon enough because it's a soulmate connection. It absolutely is. This Right over this one, we have a new soulmate connection here, and I have to sense hence the word new because we have dropping something that wasn't working first. We do. We have a completion of something that doesn't work before you meet this one. That's all there is to it. That's the truth. Closing one door, one door closes, another door opens, and that's exactly what this is. Somebody is taking back their power, probably after being ghosted by another person, expecting this person to come around. This person never comes around. They finally give up. They finally let go. They finally move on, and boom, here comes love. Here comes, here comes your best friend and lover. You can hope and pray that this is for you, if this is for you, you know. But it looks like somebody is making a huge release here. Huge release. Completion, completion, complete. Completion of one cycle is happening. There's no doubt with these tens. Three tens. Something that you have held on to is done. It's over. It's done. And it's going to lead you towards happiness and bliss. But you have to complete this cycle first. And that's the way it goes. Somebody is finding the courage and the strength to take back their power and leave a toxic situation behind for good. Congratulations. Because if this reading is for you and you are the one that is doing that, you are headed right towards a divine partnership with not only a lover but a best friend. And if you have not met this person yet, you could meet them at some sort of gathering. It could be, it could be any time. It could be in the near future. For four days, came up for some reason. I usually don't say that. I don't know where that came from. We're gonna get one of these. Somebody is dropping something and heading towards something better. Being in the flow. I'm in the flow. Of the universe. Just gonna zoom that in a little bit. Being in the flow. I am the flow of the universe. Everything is falling into place because you aren't resisting the drift of the great river of life. Let go of the shore and allow the currents to dictate your direction. You don't need to decide and plan everything yourself. Let things flow effortlessly. When you are truly in the flow, you don't need to push or exert great effort to make things happen. If there's a situation in your life that isn't falling into place, let go. It's not the right time. If there aren't smooth currents regarding a specific area of your life, it might mean that you are trying to control the outcome or that you are being overly self-critical. Know that you can flow around any obstacle. The way to do so is with gratitude and appreciation. Allow others in spirit to support and care for you. Being in the flow. Go with the flow. If something doesn't serve you, if it's holding you back from success, if it's holding you back from peace and harmony, if it's holding you back from love, then it's time to let it go. Because there's an opportunity for something really really beautiful and committed and 
It's a divine connection. It's a soulmate connection. This is a soulmate connection. These two cards, yes, it is. Together, it is. But in order to achieve this, you have to let go of something that doesn't serve you. You have to. You have to. You can't, you can't lie to yourself anymore. And you can't let other people lie to you. It's time to follow your own path and head towards happiness. So yeah, if you haven't met somebody, you could meet somebody in the next few days. Good luck. That's if you're ready, if you've let go. Some of you are still in the process of letting go. Good luck.